Hello and welcome to another two month Saturn Shooter purchase plan video. Now I believe this is the first one of 2016 and we probably are a little bit overdue so uh, we'll make a start as you can see I've got my new game sat under my modded virtual stick so we'll just move that out of the way and this is the game in question I will try and read it out and probably butcher it to turn it around it's actually uh, let's have a go so so you garante so you garante yeah that's what it is and uh, it's a horizontal no it's not I'm lying to you it's a vertical shooter but there's no Tate mode that's what I'm trying to get across to you so there's no spine card but I'm not not too fussed about the spine card obviously manual Showing some very nice pictures of the Japanese Sega Saturn controller and the 3D controller and that weird and wonderful flight stick. So, and then that's the disc itself. I think I got this from Steve Bailey. There we go. Show you the disc. Obviously, it's from Steve. It's minty fresh. Minty, minty fresh, as always. And, uh, yeah, because this is a just a normal vertical shooter with no Tarte mode, I will be showing you on my B&O CRT. So don't expect a crystal clear picture because it's never easy trying to film a CRT. But we'll, uh, we'll switch to some uh, gameplay footage now. Okay, so we're up and running. Turn the volume up. So you're probably going to see a little bit of rolling of the picture. That's just classic CRT. There's only one man I know who can film a CRT. And that's Darren, Mr. Stellaboxhead. He really does seem to have mastered the art of uh, filming. So I'll press start. 1997 I have played it um, I should really try and learn what these are these symbols but we just randomly guess and as you can see it's quite Japanese text heavy now most most of the Japanese games I've bought the shooters pretty easy to work out what to do and most of them have got English text but this one does seem to have a bit more Japanese but I'm sure with a little bit of practice I'll be able to work it out likewise with the instructions I mean all the games I've bought so far the instructions are bound to be in Japanese but some you can kind of work it out just from the pictures. So if you press and hold, just some kind of weird targeting, you can fire some missiles off. Oh yeah. Playing like a pro. And as you probably all know, I'm a big fan of uh, Donpachi, Do Donpachi. So we'll see how we get on with this. It's not quite as frantic as uh, Do Donpachi. But nonetheless, it's a nice looking game. I'm not sure if I've got any bombs. Oh, there we go, we've got some bombs. Cheating a little bit there. 
offloaded two bombs. 43%, that don't look too good, does it? Yeah, I've only just quickly tried it. Oh, 1A. B, C, C. Oh, it's my name. So that must be in some kind of time attack, score attack. Right, let's choose. Let's choose bottom one. Yeah, that's took me back to the start. Okay. Um. Yeah, I need to learn. I need to find out. Right, this looks more of a main game. And I did have a quick flip through the instruction book, and I think the coloured ships refer to strength, power, and speed. I think. Right, 2056. Here we go. Looks like I'm on the same level again. I'm not sure. Oh. Just playing around with the old buttons. So yeah, this game is classed as a budget, a budget shooter on the uh, Japanese Saturn. Can't remember how much it was, but. Around 40 50 quid, I think that's right. Oh, a little bit of slow down there. Boss time again. Right, so there we go. And that beef a bomb. talking it's because I'm concentrating oh it's getting a little bit tight oh dear a slight lapse of concentration there we go nearly did it and now I've got 27% so that percentage seems to be going down and that's a good thing a lot We'll have a quick look at the second level. Looks like we're in outer space. I wish I knew what all this Japanese text meant. Yeah, I probably said it before, but I'm not into uh, auto fire. I like something to do. Shooters. And I'll tell you what, the old uh, difficulty level seems to have stepped up. A lot more frantic now. So there we go, I think I'll leave it there guys. That is, I can't even pronounce it, so so you garante? I think it's Terror Driver, is that right? So anyway, until next time, I'll see you later on.